So recently, there's been a rumor floating around that Kylie Jenner is pregnant with Timothy Chalamet's baby, and it's currently all the internet can talk about. This has been talked about before and speculated, but it didn't get the internet into a frenzy until just last night. So a pop culture news account on Twitter called Pop Tings posted about the rumor, and that tweet said, Kylie Jenner is rumored to be pregnant, expecting a baby with Timothy Chalamet. So now everyone's talking about it. When Kylie was pregnant with her first baby, Stormy, in 2017, she hid her pregnancy until her daughter was born in 2018. She wanted to be private with her pregnancy and do things on her own terms. But over time, people slowly started to speculate that Kylie was pregnant. Like, for example, they noticed that she was posting old photos onto her Instagram as if they were new, and people figured out that they were old photos based on what Kylie's nails looked like. Very Everyone was going today. through her old photos and pretty much playing detective. They were going through her recent posts and trying to figure out when they were taken based off of old photos. They assumed she was pregnant because of all the throwback photos she was posting, and they ended up being right. So with her past pregnancy in mind and how she wanted to hide it from the world and keep it a secret, people are now looking at this rumored pregnancy in a similar light. If Kylie is hiding this pregnancy with Timothy, then she's probably going to do it in a very similar way as she did when she was pregnant with Stormy. So now people are analyzing her posts and what she's been up to to try and confirm whether or not she's pregnant. And honestly, those rumors aren't really holding up too well. There are a lot of people who don't believe that Kylie and Timothy even dated in the first place, so they definitely have their doubts about this pregnancy rumor. For starters, it's not even clear whether or not Kylie and Timothy are together right now. The reason there are breakup rumors is mainly because the last time they were spotted together publicly was at the Golden Globes in January. It's been a while. Also, Kylie did a recent interview with the New York Times last month, and when the interviewer asked her about Timothy, she declined to answer. She was asked whether Timothy could be credited with inspiring her new shift in personal style from Instagram baddie to clean girl. And she was quoted saying, I don't know how I feel about that. I just don't want to talk about personal things. It seemed odd that she didn't want to answer a question about her boyfriend, and she answered it as if they had just broken up too. Then, after that article started to get attention, Kris Jenner worked her magic, and a week later, they just happened to be spotted on an ice cream date together. Both Kylie and Timothy were wearing disguises, and you can't see their faces in the photo or any identifying features. But apparently, people found that the brown bag Kylie was wearing at the ice cream place is a bag that she wore in a past Instagram post. Then, after they were spotted on their ice cream date together, a source told Daily Mail that they were still dating, but trying to be more low-key with their relationship. The couple got a lot of attention and media coverage from attending the Golden Globes together, so they decided to pull back from the public appearances since Timothy feared that it would distract everyone from the release of his new movie, Dune 2. The insider source claimed, his career is taking off and he wants to protect it and let it thrive based on his talent, not who he is or isn't dating. He also wants to protect his relationship with with Kylie. Then the source went on to confirm that they are in fact still dating, but Timothy doesn't want the relationship to take away the attention from the new Dune movie release, which was March 1st. They are still dating, but Timothy has decided to keep a low profile with Kylie, mainly because he wants Dune 2 to get all the attention and for the movie to speak for itself. Zendaya and others from the film have also refrained from flaunting the relationships during the press tour because they want the movie to be its own thing and not have any outside drama or distractions ruining that. The source went on to say that Kylie understands and that they think the world of each other. They also added that it's expected that about a year from now, when Dune 2 starts to get nominated for awards, they'll start to become more public again with their relationship, and they'll be back to going out together and attending red carpet events as a couple. It has been speculated that the close source who's been spilling this is Miss Kris Jenner herself. People think that they actually did split up, but Kris is trying to do some damage control to keep up the appearance that they're still going strong. People just aren't buying that they're even together anymore. The Kardashians have always been pretty public with their relationships, so it's just odd that Kylie has been so low-key with someone like Timothy. They haven't even been spotted together recently. When dating rumors first started and people were speculating that they weren't actually together, we started seeing more and more paparazzi photos of them just being out and about together. We're not even seeing that. The most we're seeing is them being spotted at an ice cream place together where their faces are completely covered. There's not even a 100% chance that that was them. That could have been any random couple. Now, some fans are thinking that Kylie shut down this question is only more proof that her and Timothy are actually broken up. As just the other day, Kylie shared her morning routine on TikTok with her and her kids. And some fans think that Kylie giving her followers a look at her home life is a soft launch for her breakup with Timothy.
Kylie and Timothy have not been seen out publicly together since early January at the Golden Globes. Do Another reason people don't believe the pregnancy rumors is because of Kylie's latest Instagram posts. In the beginning of April, the Kardashian family vacationed in Turks and Caicos, and they all posted their vacation photos. Kylie posted a bunch of bikini photos, and although she could still be early in her rumored pregnancy, there was no baby bump in sight. Her stomach was completely flat. Then the most convincing debunking of this rumor is the fact that she's been drinking a lot. She just recently launched her brand Sprinter, which is a line of canned vodka sodas. To promote the brand, she's been seen all over social media drinking the beverage. And if it does come out that she is in fact pregnant, then that could be very messy of her to be seen drinking on social media just to come out later and confirm that she's been pregnant this whole time. That'd be a big yikes. But there are some people that think that this rumor is true, and they think that what actually solidifies this pregnancy rumor is that there was recently a blind item about how the Kardashians are currently filming their show, and supposedly in the season finale, they will reveal that Kylie is pregnant. Spoiler alert, keeping up with the Kardashians, the show was filming their season finale. Uh, reveals that she's pregnant again with, wait for it, Timothy Chalamet's kid. What? Holy moly! This doesn't seem too far-fetched since they've been getting so much media coverage on Kylie and Timothy and are even trying to convince everyone that they're still dating despite them not being seen out together. Like, they are trying so hard to convince everyone that they are still together. If there's any doubt about their relationship whatsoever, all of a sudden they're being spotted out together, or there's some inside source coming out to say that they are still happily together and so in love. Also, everyone thinks that Chris is the one who planted this pregnancy rumor to get people talking and speculating. The Kardashians have been getting backlash for their show being boring, so this must be their way to spice things up and get people interested in them again. Also, Kylie has been getting called out all over TikTok for her makeup brand flopping. So, people need to be distracted with something else, so why not a pregnancy rumor? Good evening, class. For today's lesson, we're going to be discussing the downfall of Kylie Jenner more specifically the downfall of her company Kylie Cosmetics and how through a series of many strategic marketing failures, it has now gotten to the point that this brand will be going bankrupt in the next two to three years. And that's being generous. Brands I firmly believe are in their flop era. First on the list, Kylie Cosmetics. I'm not even gonna sh on the products. Just please, for the love of God, give us something exciting. It's the same boring nudes over and over and over. Speaking of Kylie, $22 for a walnut scrub. Poor f for. Just get St. Ives if you truly hate your skin barrier that much. But we'll just have to wait with Kylie's future posts if it looks like she might be hiding a pregnancy or not, or just wait until the Kardashian season finale. There are also some rumors floating around about her best friend Hailey Bieber being pregnant as well, and that does seem more plausible since she has been wearing more baggy clothes and hasn't been showing off her body that much on Instagram. Like at Coachella, she was wearing a lot of loose-fitted and baggy shirts. So I do think that she's hiding a pregnancy. I think that at this point, it's kind of an open secret. So they might be pregnant together. But anyways, let me know what you guys think about this entire situation in the comments, and as always, I will talk to you in the next video.